So my name is Matt, Matt Jezik. I'm the CEO of Foldstar. We're a small startup and we are a software and a hardware company. Um, and we make things that fold. Uh, so if we, we have algorithms in the software that can take flat sheets and fold them up into really advanced shapes that operate um, very efficiently. Um, and that's actually really relevant in say the composites world where we can make something that stands up on its own um, with less material, so it's lighter and it's stiffer and it'll last longer than other materials that are out there today. So that's why we're here. And a lot of the people that we're working with are interested in using either metals or obviously we're at a composite show. So this is a Kevlar and carbon fiber uh, sample that we made um, using our proprietary software and the machines that we make back in our shop. Um, back in Princeton, New Jersey. So our software and our hardware matter in composites because stiffness and weight are the most important things. So if I can cut down 20% of the weight of a part and make it 20% stiffer, then that will work a lot more efficiently for the types of problems we're trying to solve. Um, and more importantly, these materials are easy to fabricate. Like I could make, with our proprietary machines, make miles of this, um, different patterns that we have much more efficiently than some of the other fabrication techniques that people use today. So I was told that honeycomb is uh, one application that you could use this in. Is that the only one or is, or is that the primary one that you would you know, use this for or recommend people to use this for? Yeah, we think, um, so honeycombs are, are this kind of idea of a structural core where you have a, a carbon fiber on two sides and then this material in the middle, like a sandwich, like you're making a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Um, so we can make a more efficient version of that for uh, aerospace, for automotive, uh, for various other people that need really, really strong parts that will last a long time and are very lightweight. Yeah, so that's our primary um, initial target, but the applications for this um, are in a lot of different industries. So we have people that are using these things in uh, consumer products, in packaging. So getting rid of all the shrink wrap plastic that you have and just literally using like a piece of cardboard like this instead of uh, plastic that you have to recycle or just toss in the landfill somewhere. Uh, so we think that that's actually much more efficient. Uh, so think about all those Amazon boxes that you have that come to your door every day. How can we make that much more efficient too? You obviously have some preset designs, but can people also do custom based off what they need? Absolutely, yeah. So uh, our proprietary software lets you basically take the best of additive fabrication, so 3D printing, where you can make a really, really lightweight part by taking away all the stuff that you don't need. We can do that exact same thing, and that makes, doesn't have to be a repeating pattern. It can be a very specialized, like, add more stuff here, take it away where you don't need it. Um, so basically you get the best of 3D printing and the best of traditional manufacturing because you can do this at scale. You can make a lot of it.